Hey, good morning. Yes, and that is one thing that we don't typically think about during the holiday season. What are we going to do with all of that trash after the fact? And that is why I came here to the Roseville Utility Center and uh, Brayden, you're joining me yeah. here this morning because you guys have an event for the whole family to come on out, right, mostly yeah. targeting adults, though. Definitely, yeah. To teach them a thing or two on what to do with all of the waste that they're going to have during this holiday season. So tell us, what's going on here with these boxes? I use that to tease because sure. it's a snowman. It is. I mean, you got it. <laughs> here in Roseville, we don't get a lot of snow, so we had to come up with our own way of building a snowman. Yes. But just one of the things, exactly like you said, we're shopping online a lot these days. There's a lot of boxes around our house, and uh, our utility just wants to remind people that when you go to throw those away mm -hmm. uh, we have recycle bins all throughout the city all throughout the county actually and we just ask that you flatten those uh, this box that you're looking at right now that stack is the exact same amount of cardboard as uh, our cardboard snowman right there oh so you can gosh. see just flattening that it's gonna save a ton of space and allow your neighbors and your friends to put their cardboard away as well okay so that event that you're having yeah. when is that happening so that's going on right now so we're open uh, Tuesday through Saturday from 10 to 5 and that's going on the entire time that we're open through the rest of this week, through uh, this Saturday. Uh, folks can come in and uh, get a scavenger hunt and work on that scavenger hunt as a family. Uh, it's a lot of fun. It's interactive. There's some questions that are just for fun. Uh, and and then they get to go home with a great prize from the utility. Yes, and I really enjoy these prizes. I already got to play with a couple of them. I got Scott Holcomb this one. It's to scrape all of his oil. I taught him a lesson because I learned that here last time that I was here. And then the kiddos get to have some fun. Scott, look. I don't know if you guys can see through the camera, but look at those lights. Oh, yeah. Oh, that is cool. They become little stars. Yeah. It's so cool. And then this is one of my favorite things, too. So check this out. All of these LED lights, that's how many watts you're, you're wasting with that, right? But so, Yeah, so these two right here, we have the incandescent lights, the colorful ones right there. Mm -hmm. um, those are using the exact same amount of energy. That's a maybe 100 lights to the same number of lights. We have about 1,000 of these white LED lights, and they're both using the same amount of energy. Yeah. So you can tell by just simply switching to uh, the LED lights, you're going to save energy because you probably won't. Griswold too far right. on your house. Um, but even if you do, you're able to go a lot farther, save a lot of energy. Um, typically, most Americans will actually increase their energy use this time of year by about 25%. Oh. Um, so by simply switching to LEDs, that's going to help a ton. Yeah, and really definitely. On that bill. The bank account, yeah. yes. Yeah. Um, but we don't have enough time. We wanted to do a little uh, present competition, but we're going to do it for online folks. So if you're on Instagram and you follow us on Good Day, go on there. We're going to post that video. We're going to yeah. see who's going to win, and we're going to give you win. some more info on that, too. But I'll toss it back to you all okay. in the studio for now so I can get ready all for right. this competition. Yeah, there you go. There you go. We did it online because that way they.